So we are on section D, question number 32, and it's given the question that one observer estimates the angle of elevation to the basket of a hot air balloon to be 60 degree, while another uh, observer 100 meter away observes the est uh, observe 100 meter away estimates the angle of elevation to be 30 degree. So let's try to sketch the situation. Let's say this is the basket of the hot air balloon and this is the ground where the observer is and this is the height of the basket from the ground and this is the angle of elevation of the first observer and the angle of elevation of the second observer and the angle of elevation of the first observer is 60 degree while the second observer the first observer is at A and this is B, which is 30 degree. Or let's say AB is the height of the hot air balloon from the ground AB. C is the first observer and B is the second observer. And the distance between them is over a meter. Okay, now we have to find the height of the basket from the ground. So first of all, we have find we have to find out A B, and B part says this is part A, and for B part, distance of the basket from the first observer's eye, which is A C, and then we have to find the horizontal distance of the second observer from the basket. So horizontal distance from the second observer from the basket is from the horizontal distance of the second observer from the basket, <clears throat> which is so this is the horizontal distance of the second observer from the basket means we have to find out this distance. The basket horizontal distance which is bd so we have to find bd now let's find out ab that is the height and for that let's take this uh, right angle triangle so this right angle triangle a b c if we use tan of 60 which will give us ab by bc and tan 60 is the root 3 so this is ab and bc if we cross multiply this this will give us ab is equal to bc into this let's say first equation and now in the right angle triangle a b d and this is tan 30 which is equal to ab by bd now tan 30 is 1 by root 3 and AB we have the AB with from the first equation which is BC root 3 and BD can be split up into DC plus BC and DC is 100 so this is 1 by root 3 is equal to BC the root 3 value of DC is 100 plus BC if we cross multiply this this will give us root 3 into bc root 3 is 3 bc which is equal to 100 plus bc now 3 bc minus bc this is 3 bc minus bc which is equal to 100 which is 2 bc is equal to 100 now bc is equal to 50 so bc is equal to 50 meter and this is equal to 50 meter but we have to find a b so from one so from one we can get a b which is the height of the basket from the ground which is b c is 50 so this is 50 root 3 so we have got a b which is 50 root 3 now let's find out a c so a b is 50 root 3 and we have to find a c so we can use 
the sine ratio so in right angled triangle a b c if we use sine 60 which is a b by b c and sine 60 is root 3 by 2 a b so a b is 50 root 3 b c is so sorry it's not a b by b c sine is it's a b by a c so this is a c root 3 root 3 gets cancelled and a c is equal to 100 meter so the horizontal distance of the first observer from the distance of the basket from the first observer's eye is 100 meter and let's find out the third one so <coughs> we have got the height of the basket from the ground which is 50 root 3 and the horizontal distance of the basket from the first observer's eye which is 100 meter and now we have to find the horizontal distance of the second observer from the basket. so horizontal distance is this one which is 100 plus 50 so horizontal distance of the distance of the second observer is 100 plus 50 which is equal to 150 meter so 50 root 300 and 150 are the respective answers of the questions that were asked in the question so this also the question number 32 let's move on to the next one